Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this 2021 Integra Odyssey 30Z double slide Class C gas motorhome. Go ahead and get started on the inside and then finish up by showing you the outside. Overall exterior length is 32 feet 6 inches. Exterior height to the large 15,000 BTU AC unit and full walk-on fiberglass roof big deal is uh, 11 feet 6 inches give you an idea of the floor plan here before I get started this is a one owner coach the only reason why the owner is selling it so quickly is because he is having some health issues and we'll just leave it at that but uh, it's been on two trips to Florida and it's been to Ohio and right now it currently has 9,717 miles on it and I'll show that off when we do the cockpit walkthrough. All right, double slide coach. Uh, first slide out's definitely a super slide. It's gonna be at least 12 foot long, two feet deep. Accommodates the ultra leather boot dinette. Table breaks down into a bed. Looks like you have 110 and uh, USB charging ports up underneath the boot dinette. Show off that hinge system for collapsing down the table. Definitely sleep uh, two kiddos on this easily. Uh, I think they're rating this as sleeping seven. Also in the super slide is the theater seating and that's ultra leather. I'll show off the colors. It's gonna be like a, a gray color. Uh, all the fabrics, everything are in excellent condition on the inside of this coach. Obviously it's a 2021. It's a little dirty. The owners had not had a chance to detail it. Uh, does have seat belts recliner just pull the lever there and while I've got good lighting on the window treatments I always like to show, show off the window treatments uh, it's gonna be some colors of uh, looks to be some blacks uh, gray some tans maybe some cream colors you do have uh, the blackout shades Not sure what they're calling the cabinet color, but they're all solid wood cabinet drawer fronts. Looks to be like a black finish, matte black finish on the hardware. Beautiful cabinets, by the way, the color. Spin around here. Let's start in the kitchen area here. Kind of back up, show off the kitchen and the cabinets. Solid surface countertops, double bowl sink, show that off, undermounted sink, see it's a little dirty. Nice uh, power tower here, which is really cool, they should have done that a long time ago. Full extension metal ball bearing drawer guides. You do have a convection, not just a microwave. Stainless steel finish on the fronts of your appliances. Nice stainless steel hood. Uh, really nice backsplash, by the way. For a Class C, that's definitely one of the nicer ones you're gonna find. And uh, of course, it's a little dirty, as I said, but uh, you do have that glass lid for more counter space on your three burner Furion uh, stove top. Nice LED light accent Furion does with these new ovens that they're offering and back up here show off the eight cubic foot gas electric uh, nor cold refrigerator and it does have that new uh, uh, pa wood paneling that they're offering even on the refrigerator door fronts Entertainment center area here. No, I'm not sure what the size is. I forgot to check. I believe it's going to be at least a 50 inch insignia. Show off that insignia badge right there. And you do have two tone cabinets. With brush nickel hardware on the cabinets in the entertainment center area. That's actually pretty neat the way they did that. It's one of the first I've seen them do that on a Class C. Uh, your Furion fireplace is going to be a, at least a 4800 uh, BTU heating source. 
Your furnace on this coach is 30,000 BTUs. And as I pointed out, your AC is going to be the large 15,000 BTU ducted AC unit with quick dump. Open up these louvers and it does a quick dump. Once it's cooled off, close them off and you are ducted AC all throughout. Your floors, obviously the wood plank floor look and it's the residential grade vinyl flooring. Easy to sweep out on your high traffic area. Vanity area here in the closet going back to the master bedroom. With mirror. Or I'm sorry, medicine cabinet, not just a mirror. And lots of storage, by the way, in the closet area here in the hallway. All right. Uh, the queen bed is a slide out and it slides out the very rear which is a really neat concept they've been offering on a lot of models so that's definitely a neat neat idea uh, and paint around here it's full walk around queen bed and again the uh, darker wood finish on the cabinets in the bedroom nice uh, LED reader lights there You do have 110 outlets on each side of the bed. Spin around here if you wanted the TV in the bedroom. That's where you'd mount the TV up top there. Good view of the bathroom. Foot flush china toilet, glass enclosed shower with skylight. Nice sprayer, by the way. Okay. Solid wood pocket door to close off for privacy from the living area into the uh, hallway bathroom area and back up here. Another uh, solid wood pocket door for privacy uh, from the bedroom into the vanity hallway area. All right, you get the idea. Speed up this video a little bit. Give you one last look. Oh, nice LED light accent above the slide out fascia up top there. All right. The front of this is just awesome. Uh, the idea is just really neat. And plus these uh, uh, USB charging ports on each side and 110 outlets on each side. So if you've got two kiddos or two grown adults up here, they have a place to put their items and store uh, smart devices. But that panoramic window is definitely the coolest uh, I've ever seen on a Class C with the power shade. And let's close that. Because after I'm done here, the owner is going to Put it away so i don't want the sun to do any damage okay before we go outside i'm going to show off the monitor panel here this is your central command the generator has 75 hours on the jenny it's a 4000 onan uh, generator and slide out buttons one and two easy to figure out start and stop button for your generator this is your monitor panel for your batteries which has two upgraded lithium uh, deep cycle marine batteries and they're brand new uh, fresh water tank, black tank, which is the toilet, and uh, the gray tank is your sink and shower, and your six gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater switches, whether you're boondocking or hooked up to shore power, 15 minutes, you have hot water, water pump switch, easy to figure out, and this is equipped with 12 volt tank heater pads, uh, 12 volt pads, heat pads, uh, and uh, keeps your tanks nice and warm. Down below here, light switches, and then your outside speakers you can turn them off and on and lights awning button and one of the best features probably on the outside of this coach is the uh, auto leveling system definitely nice and convenient to have on a class C turn off this generator so I'm not yelling 
again it's loud outside we're next to a, a busy highway so i do apologize i don't know if i apologized in the beginning but it's loud so i do apologize ahead of time before we go outside i will point out all the features just in case uh, you don't hear it in the video uh, when i get outside full walk-on fiberglass roof huge deal beautiful front molded cap with the panoramic windshield big deal on this coach uh and the uh, uh the auto leveling is is probably going to be definitely one of the most expensive features on this coach that you won't find on most class c's and the 7.3 liter uh engine uh which i'll go into detail when we show off that new new design front on the ford e450 chassis well good there's not a lot of traffic right now uh, E450 chassis, all brand newly designed. Nice spoiler on the front there, which is really neat. That's how you tell, really tell if it's a 2021 versus a 2020. Beautiful front, molded, gel coated, uh, fiberglass cap with the panoram panoramic windshield. Show that off in that Integra badge. It's dirty on the outside, so the owners had not had a chance to detail it. E450 chassis, three, I'm sorry, 7.3 liter gasoline engine, V8. It's 350 horsepower, uh, 468 foot pounds of torque with 7,500 pound towing capability versus what they offered in 2020, which was just the Triton V10, uh, 305 horsepower and only 420 foot pounds of torque. So this is definitely the chassis you want, definitely for uh, 2021. 16 foot power awning i will point out the awning does have a little tear the owner got into something and i'll point that out right there it's really it's just cosmetic uh it still functions but he got into something uh awnings i think are about 400 bucks if you wanted to replace it exterior tv i believe it's going to be a 32 inch flat screen and it might be a 28 i believe it's a 28. Kind of show off uh decals are all in excellent condition it's a 2021 it's only been owned for about eight months and as i said it's only been to florida uh and back twice and it's been to ohio exterior uh, storage compartments uh, neatly finished really nice finish on your uh, storage compartments here oh nice little cable wire that they do they should have done that a long time ago on the class c's because usually these doors just hang down and anyway it's just little things like that it's pretty cool exterior speakers i already pointed that out lp tank i believe is a 12 gallon lp tank all right it's going to be more storage and these are your booster seats and i forgot to point out probably one of the coolest features in the cockpit uh the cockpit co-pilot and the pilot seat swivel which you do not usually get on a class c Tires are in excellent condition. Hand cooked tires. More storage. There's your low point drain valves in case you want to winterize. Nice and convenient. Gas grill hookup right there. Huge storage in the rear or your garage storage. And this is all up underneath that bed. And you have two other access doors on the back and on the back side and I'll show that to you oh yeah look at that pretty cool back up here kind of show off what that front back side looks like again full walk on uh, fiberglass roof big deal on this coach and you do have the side view camera package and the backup camera. And for 2021, this is the new backup cameras. They're smaller. Uh, anyway, they're a lot cleaner look. A lot of big features on 21, 2021 models. And again, your rear storage. 7,500 pound towing capability. Show off that badge. There it is, 7,500 pounds. You do have the slide out awning package. This coach is pretty much fully loaded. It is fully loaded. 
well, with the exception of the full body paint, but most of them aren't going to have the full body paint. Uh, this is the only real uh, issue that if anybody wants a, an absolutely 100% mint condition Class C, the owner got into it when he was going up a hill, and it's a non-issue. It just scraped the bottom of it a little bit. little metal trim piece right there. But anyway, I found it important to point all that stuff out. Uh, it's in great condition. Uh, and I think the way that the owner is going to have it priced, it's definitely uh, well worth the money. Outside shower, hot and cold running water, 55-gallon fuel cell. Uh, I believe, but yeah, black tank sewer flush right here washes out your toilet. Water connection there. Show off that Odyssey badge right there. Your windows are going to be 80% window tinting, and uh, those are frameless bus style windows. They're calling this a, a gel coat. I, I'd call it just a high gloss, but but they are calling it a gel coat. It's easier to clean than your regular fiberglass pylon. Okay, more storage. And again, those cables are just really convenient. That's going to be your 30 amp power cord in there. Another low point drain valve. More storage. And the owner did say all the sewer hoses, all the stuff come with it uh, for hookups. And there's your own in 4,000 I believe what I say 75 hours on it something like that and there's your side view camera uh, this is missing a wheel simulator uh, those are a non-issue I pointed out on the other side to show, show what they look like but if, he, he doesn't know when it fell off so Show off that new digital dash. Let's see if yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's all new new design dash. 9,717 miles. There's your forward badge right there. New steering wheel design. Uh, let's show off the dash. And of course your uh, Sony radio, and this is obviously uh, smart device ready, and you can uh, bring up your camera backup camera and your side view cameras when you turn your turn signal on most people know how to do that now nice usb charging right there 468 foot pounds of torque and 350 horsepower definitely neat and show off the top there and these seats do swivel around I'm not sure if I pointed it out, but these are the new keys for Ford. Take a little bit to get used to that. Oh, this coach does have the owner bottom uh, WeatherTech floor mats. It's about a $150 feature right there. All right. As I said, wheel simulator needs to be replaced. That spoiler on that front end really does look sharp. And that's really one of the quickest ways you could tell if it's a, the new chassis with the 7.3 liter gasoline engine. I know I didn't get everything. These Integra Odysseys have a ton of stuff on it. Anyway, if you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And if you want to come out and see the coach, just call the number on the ad. You deal directly with the owner, or you can call. 502-645-3124 and if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook.